What's going on, everybody? I want to talk about ownership and taking responsibility for your journey. I was accused recently uh, through the grapevine of being uh, a messenger of aggressive ownership. And I'm not honestly sure if I'm taking that as a criticism or as a compliment because I really believe that ownership of your journey is something that too many people don't have. We live in a society that is focused on appearances, quick fixes, and finding other people to be responsible for your problems. You are responsible for your position in life. It doesn't matter what's happened to you in the past. It doesn't matter the circumstances you are in right now. Your story, the story of your life is written by how you respond to the things that happen to you in life. That's it. The things that happen and how you respond. How you respond is going to determine if things are good or bad in your life. Your mentality about how you perceive and react to things is going to determine if you feel happy or not. Happiness is a decision. It is not something that happens to you. You can prepare and do things to prepare mentally and prepare physically for things to go wrong for things to not happen the way that you planned, for eventualities and circumstances that you may not have thought about and have to deal with. That's what life is. Life is about the unexpected. Life is about being prepared or not prepared, if that's, if that's where you're at, to handle things that you didn't plan on happening. Your fitness, your nutrition, and your mindset, your mental health are all things that you can work on to give yourself the best quality of life, to enable you to provide and prepare for the positive and learning experiences that life is going to throw your way. And that's how you need to look at them. Things happen. I can pull something out of here that's going to be good for me. I can learn something from this. It may set me back financially. It may set me back time-wise. It may set me back in my work. It may cause something negative to happen in my life, but that doesn't mean that my whole life has to be defined by that event or these circumstances. You can find a way to make something positive out of it. Find motivation, learn something new, gain some knowledge, learn an experience so that you know how not to repeat something in the, in the, in the future. There's always something good. When it comes to your fitness, your fitness level directly relates to your ability to manage and handle stress. Manage and manage and handle stress. Your nutrition, the food that you eat, directly relates to the the uh, effect of stress, what you already have your body that you're dealing with in your body, and how you have the energy and the functioning ability in your body to handle additional stress and fight disease and fight illness and fight viruses all those things. Your mental health, the ability of you to look at things in abundance and have a positive outlook on life will drastically change your ability to deal with stress, to deal with negative actions of others, to deal with negative circumstances that are put into your life. You have to be the source of positivity because you cannot be guaranteed that other people are going to give it to you. No one is coming to save you you are responsible for your own lifestyle, your own success, and your own positive outlook on life. 